What is going on guys and welcome back to another player review. We have Informal Bamiyang and for some reason EA always just never upgrade his pace. No matter how many informs he gets, it is very rare for EA to upgrade his pace. They just like, fuck it, this guy is too fast, there is no point of doing that. So, let's begin. If you guys are looking for a cheap and reliable place to get your coins, check out battle.com. The link will be in the description and use the code Itani to get 5% off. If you want PSN cards or Microsoft points to open packs for this team of the week, check out G2A. The link will also be in the description and use the code Itani for a discount. Now, with Bamiyang, his biggest selling point has to be that 95 pace. That is a lot of pace right there. And sometimes I found it hard to dribble with him just because of how fast he is. It's not because he has bad dribbling or anything like that. He has decent dribbling, but because of how fast he is, it's so hard to stop him sometimes and dribble, if you guys could, could understand what I'm trying to say. So pace of using with this guy, let's say, is pretty much amazing. You'll easily get past any defender. doesn't matter if it's a legend defender. It doesn't matter who you have in, in defense. doesn't matter if you have a fast striker. None will actually catch up to Aubameyang because of how fast he is. Finishing in the penalty area was awesome. Like I said, these fast players seem to have awesome finishing because the goalkeepers, as soon as they try and come out of the goal, if you have a fast player, you just run past them diagonally and you could just easily score. Finesse it past the keeper uh, to the near post. He's also got good agility and you'll see in the clips where defenders stick their leg out, he could easily change direction so quickly and carry on running with that 95 pace. And if you make one little mistake and predict the wrong direction he's going to, that's it, he's through on to go. He is so quick, you have to think so quickly with your defenders. And as you guys know, in FIFA 15, defending is really hard sometimes because some people are, well, some opponents are really unpredictable of what they sort of do. And Aubameyang makes it even harder. So keep that in mind, guys. He's very effective in this game, especially for the for how oriented pace is in this game. He is very, very effective. Like I was saying in the penalty area, once you reach the penalty area, it is so easy to finish with him. You'll see me finish nearly every opportunity with him. Now, he has that three-star weak foot and three-star skill, so keep that in mind. You skillers out there, you're not going to buy him for the skills or anything like that. You're just going to buy him to run on to go, force your way into the penalty area, and just basically score. Now, he is weak as well, so I, I thought he would be quite strong compared to other fast players, but he wasn't. He was easily bullied off the ball if a defender can actually predict which way you're going. So keep that in mind, he's not the strong he's not a strong fast player. He's quite weak. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, I'd really appreciate a like. I am going to be bringing out an inf an informed David Silver review later on today, but Inform Obamiang as a striker gets a 9.2 out of 10.